Makeup Assistant BAS animation tool is meant to provide three different examples to show how the Backup Assistant system can work on your forklift application. The Backup Assistant system minimizes the risk of collision for manned fork trucks. The system is based on a TIM 351 2D LiDAR that monitors the area around the vehicle which are obstructed from view of the driver as you can see on the two different fields shown back of the truck there. The compact control module provides an electrical interface to the vehicle and facilitates sensing and alerts via a signal light bar. The signal light bar gives real-time feedback via visual and audible warnings when the TIM sensor detects a stationary or moving object near the truck. The control module also provides input to the system so that it's engaged only when the fork truck is in reverse, thereby eliminating false alarms when the moving forward. And then the monitoring areas can be easily adjusted for the system and it can be scaled up by adding an additional sensor. So this animation shows three different typical BAS use cases. We can start by just clicking on the start button on one and you can see how Kim sensor is gonna be utilized here. In this case, the truck moves forward and it will pick up the load and then it backs up and you can see how the sensing area in multiple uh, iterations of it, it goes in reverse. You can see the green and then once the detection fields become in contact with, the, in this case, a, a pallet of goods, you can see it'll change from a yellow to a red. And then also the audible alerts will be from a, a pulsing to a solid tone in that case. So this shows just the, the basic functionality of how the system works. And I'm gonna to switch to the second use case. In this use case, you see that there are two sensors mounted. One would be on the upper back of the truck and the second one would be mounted uh, at the bottom there, both facing to, you know, backwards from the vehicle. And in this use case, it would be an, an application where maybe there's very frequently moved objects or object maybe placed behind that the truck is, is parked for some time. So in this case, starting here, you can see that again, the load is picked up and as it backs up, you can see both of the signal light bars are green. And then as it is comes and detects the pallet of goods there, in this example, you can see the bottom sensor has gotten into the stop field. So you can see the bottom signal light bar has a red LED and then the upper sensor is still in the warning field. So you can see that it is a, a yellow LED. Also we want to highlight that the LED, both the LED and the audible alert on the signal light bar are configurable. So you can change the brightness levels of the LED and the audible level up to 98 decibels on buzzer on the, the signal light bar. So this shows how that can be adjusted and, and be flexible depending on one or two sensors and your environmental settings for, for that particular truck application. Now the third case is a little bit different in that it has two sensors, but they are mounted, as you can see, on the back corners of the vehicle. So if I start this one, you can see again, it comes and picks it up. But in this case, you might wanna have better definition of either corner or possibly say one on the back and one on the side. So you have more definition of the, the detection area that the sensor is gonna be able to pick up an object. The object on this detection, the right-hand side sensor as you're looking at the back of the truck is detecting the pallet here. So you can see that is in a, a red field, but the left-hand side is, is basically not detecting anything. So it is still in a, in a green uh, operating mode. So that gives the flexibility of being able to detect two different fields depending on that use case, if it's maybe close to the side or further apart on either side of the vehicle. So these are the three use cases that are used. You know, the animation really shows how the BAS can be added in a very flexible way to a fork truck. And it really is a compact, easy retrofit solution for risk avoidance.